Are there differences between male and female sexuality that we should be aware of? What role do fantasies play in sexuality? Hello to all lovers of psychology and sexuality. Today, we will unveil the sexual curiosities of women. If you are interested in these topics, make sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell to not miss our future videos. Also, leave us comments and share your experiences in the section below. Let's get started. In sexuality, common differences are observed. Female response is more complex, contextual, while male response tends to be more direct. Although men often report higher sexual desire, this varies individually. Open communication and mutual understanding are key to healthy sexual relationships. Sexual fantasies are common and can play a significant role in arousal and sexual satisfaction. They are a natural way to explore desires and preferences, as long as they stay within the boundaries of respect and consent. Respect for limits. Respecting the partner's limits is fundamental. If someone does not feel comfortable or is not interested in trying anal sex, those limits should be respected. Risk of infections. The risk of infections may increase with anal sex due to the presence of bacteria in the area. Using condoms can reduce this risk. Role-playing games are a common way to explore sexual fantasies. Couples can take on roles and scenarios to unleash their creativity and enhance sexual arousal. Sense of humor. A good sense of humor can be very attractive to many women. The ability to make someone laugh is often considered a desirable quality. Sex and cardiovascular health. Sex is a physical exercise that can benefit cardiovascular health. Some studies suggest that sexually active people may have a lower risk of heart disease. Sex and creativity. Sex and creativity are related in various ways. Many artists and writers have found inspiration in their sex lives. The connection between artistic expression and intimacy can be a source of innovation and personal expression. Sex and heart health. Regular sex can be beneficial for heart health. It has been shown that regular sexual activity reduces the risk of cardiovascular disease. Sex and longevity. Several studies have shown that an active sex life may be related to greater longevity. Endorphins released during sex can reduce stress and improve mood, contributing to a longer and healthier life. Sex education in the Netherlands. The Netherlands is known for its comprehensive sex education, starting at an early age and focusing on open communication and consent. This has led to lower rates of teenage pregnancy and sexually transmitted diseases compared to other countries. Sex in space. As space exploration advances, the question arises about how sex will take place in space. Microgravity conditions may pose unique challenges for sexual activity. Sex in water, such as in a pool or bathtub, can be a common fantasy. However, water can remove the body's natural lubrication, leading to uncomfortable friction. Sex phobia. Genophobia is the extreme fear or aversion to sex. It can be debilitating and is often related to past traumatic experiences. Sexual therapy and counseling can be helpful in overcoming this phobia. Sexual desire in menopause. Menopause can affect women's sexual desire due to hormonal changes. However, many women experience increased sexual freedom after menopause. Sexual motivations. The University of Texas conducted research identifying 237 different motivations for having sex. Interestingly, having children and relieving tension are no longer the main reasons. Other motivations include getting closer to God, burning calories, returning a favor, changing the topic of conversation, and even getting rid of a headache. This study demonstrates that human sexual motivations are extremely complex. Sexual therapy is a form of treatment that can help individuals overcome sexual issues, such as dysfunction, lack of desire, or intimacy-related concerns. Sexual therapists are trained to address a wide range of sexual problems. Sexuality in ancient Egypt, in ancient Egypt, sexuality was considered a natural part of life and was reflected in Egyptian art and mythology. Sex was viewed as a divine act. Shared passions and interests. Sharing common interests and hobbies can strengthen a connection. Finding common ground and enjoying activities together can be attractive. Sleep paralysis is a terrifying experience where a person temporarily wakes up unable to move. 
Occasionally, people report sexual experiences during these episodes. Smile. A sincere and kind smile is attractive to many people, as it is associated with kindness and empathy. Studies on the clitoris. Despite the importance of the clitoris in female sexual response, there has been a lack of research on this organ compared to the penis. However, there has been an increased focus on clitoral research in recent years. Tantric sex is a practice that focuses on emotional connection and deep intimacy. It emphasizes control of arousal and can lead to prolonged and satisfying sexual experiences. The effect of meditation, meditation, and mindful practices can enhance sexual life by reducing stress and increasing mind-body connection. These practices can help people be more present during sex and enjoy it more fully. The effect of spicy foods. Spicy foods can increase heart rate and sweating, which could mimic some of the physical responses to sex, leading to the idea that they can be aphrodisiacs. The heart during orgasm Orgasm can significantly accelerate your heart rate. In some cases, the heart rate can reach 180 beats per minute during an orgasm. However, note that this does not replace regular physic. The influence of pornography on expectations. Pornography can influence sexual expectations. It's important to remember that pornography is a fictional representation of sexuality and should not be seen as a standard for real sexual life. The internal clitoris. The clitoris is not just the small visible button at the top of the vulva. It has an internal structure that extends into depth. Stimulation of the internal clitoris can be an additional source of pleasure for some women. The relationship between sex and mental health, mental health and sexuality are interconnected. Having a healthy sex life can contribute to better emotional well-being and reduce anxiety and depression. The science of kissing. Kissing is not only a display of affection, but also involves a complex chemical interaction. Kisses can increase the release of hormones related to bonding and pleasure. Time and patience. Anal sex requires time, patience, and gradualness. Rushing can result in discomfort or pain. Types of orgasm. Women can experience different types of orgasms, including clitoral, vaginal, and G-spot orgasms. Some women also experience combined orgasms involving multiple areas of stimulation. Unusual fetishes. Fetishes can vary widely, and some individuals have unusual sexual interests. This may include an attraction to objects, specific roles, or unique situations. Vaginal orgasm versus clitoral orgasm. While clitoral stimulation is a common source of female orgasms, some women may experience vaginal orgasms from stimulation of the anterior vaginal wall known as the G-spot. Virginity. The perception of virginity and its importance varies widely depending on culture and time. In some places, it is highly valued, while in others, it is considered less relevant. Voice. A man's voice can be attractive to some women. A deep and confident voice is sometimes perceived as more attractive. Human sexuality is a fascinating and diverse field that never ceases to amaze us. Sexual curiosities unveil the wonderful complexity of the human experience in the intimate realm. As we explore and understand these facts, it is crucial to remember that each individual is unique in their sexual experience. Respecting and communicating with your partner are the keys to a satisfying and healthy sexual life. Sexual education and understanding are essential tools for fully embracing our sexuality.